So yeah, this year's been quite an amazing journey for me. Um, I've confronted some fears, I think, around working in a community arts context. Um, so there's been two focuses of, of my um, professional development that I've undertaken this year. And one has been workshop facilitation, and I've done internships with um, Milk Craig Theatre and Shopfront Contemporary Youth Arts. And I've discovered I really enjoy that. I, I, I really like it. I'm told I'm, I'm pretty good at it. And as a consequence, as I've been employed at Milk Crate Theatre um, to run their workshop program, and that's exciting. It's my very first permanent arts position and their hen's teeth to get, um, so I'm very grateful. Um, and I've worked with people with disabilities at Back to Back um, in their summer school, and so that was an amazing experience to sort of get over that fear I guess of not knowing what that's like and so the last four weeks I've brought together um, some workshops bringing together those facilitation skills and the devising skills. Um, today I've taken my participants through um, quite a long exercise which I um, learnt at um, summer school with Back to Back Theatre and we've gone on a walk through Newtown to the graveyard. Uh, we did a short viewpoint session there where they explored doing a physical improvisation outside and then we've returned and without any discussion they've sat down with some textures and some paper to draw a map uh, and then they've spent some time writing and now I've set them a task to in 20-30 minutes create a small performance together using that stimulus and I can just see through um, the doors in there that they're rehearsing they're on their feet it's one of the dangers of um, devising theatre is you the group will be scared to move um, they're scared and they talk, 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 but this group, um, you know, they're working well and they're up on their feet, so it's exciting and I'm looking forward to seeing what they, um, they come up with. Zen Zen Zoo in Brisbane, but I first encountered um, viewpoints which were canonised by Anne Bogart and her city company in New York State uh, in the late 90s. I came across her techniques um, in readings at university and was inspired. It was one of those moments where everything came together and clunk, 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 and all the other methods of working uh, as a director and an actor uh, were able to be seen clearly through the frame of the viewpoints for me and the viewpoints are architecture, tempo, duration, uh, kinesthetic response, spatial relationship, um, topography, floor pattern, so it's the, the shape that you would make if you put paint on the bottom of your feet and you walk through the space. Um, so I, it's really been um, an exciting process. I had an amazing experience with Zen Zen Zo. Great 
large exposed roots in the graveyard. I think for me, I just really struggled with my internal tempo today and, and, and trying to make that match, you know, because of the heat and feeling slow in my body, but feeling fast in my head and, and trying to make that match and trying to get that in tune with other people. That was just really, I think, yeah, I think tempo for me is just a really big one and how to resolve when it's, uh, when they're opposite or when they, when they don't meet together. I really like the idea of going out. That was so fruitful, that little walk. And, you know, like it was so stimulating once we got to, we weren't even in the graveyard, we were just on the, um, the entrance. And it was a marvellous tree, wasn't it? And just the paving stones and the little picket fence. And I, I just thought that was beautiful. And, and yeah, it, it showed up, we, we, made a little, we made something, didn't we? Um, I, I can't get over this, how, how important viewpoint is. Mm. You know, like it's really brought that to life with me this, this, this week. It did last week too, but even the, with the outside stimulus, it made it even more interesting. Mm. Okay. Thank you. The four of us just worked so well together and we were so respectful of each other's decisions. Like nobody said, oh, that's a stupid idea or even if we might have thought it, you know. It, it, there was just a lot of... Um, acknowledge you know every single one of us had an opinion and I think that we included in the little piece what what most you know everything was considered yeah and I could see quite clearly the viewpoints mm. session in that performance yes. like it was really interesting normally towards the end of a devising process in the time there would be this scary scary stress stress you guys were so calm like you were ignoring me I was taking the time <laughs> <laughs> It's an interesting experience, I think, um, you know, to see what, what you can make in a short period of time. Um, so, yeah, that's my journey this year. <laughs>